All right. Couple quick updates. <coughs> One. That stunt I pulled on John D. With the immaculately conceived eggs. Did it again? On a. But I did it better. So, eat piece of bread, arms, hands, fingers, feet, legs, toes. So, limbs. I had some uh, ham, heart, liver, lungs. Kidneys. I might have missed liver, actually. But heart, lungs, and kidneys. Um, Skanda. Rasana. Uradana. Nasika. Okay, so, like, the, the eggs, in addition to being, you know, Mary Ann's eggs. Yeah, so I said your zombie's numbing. I took two of Mary Ann's eggs and immaculately fertilized them. With immaculate conception. Because that dude thinks he's better than Jesus. And, let's see. Pertha, back. On a chest, Trika. It was gross, but I went ahead and chanted something to be as Pumsina, Anda, Pody, Payu, Muka. You know, his face is bomb. Wrecked him. Dang, you killed him. Um, let's see what else. Uh, each of them, because they were uh, one-eyed jacks, or uh, or uh, basically like a uh, an egg inside a piece of toast. So each of them became one eye, one ear. One became the tongue and li uh, lips. The other became the nose. That's uh, that's most of a human body right there. Trika is the groin. Basically, I haven't done the abdomen. Oh, I did the stomach. Yeah, yeah. So I haven't done, like, the liver. Yeah, I haven't done the liver yet. I haven't done the brain or the bones. Or any alleged toupee. However, that is where the fun begins. So, in previous videos, we discovered that there is a P involved. So... The, uh, the person who I referred to before, uh, one of the, so there are four other people I referred to, referred to before. They are associated with, uh, well, the other four towers, as I'm associated with, like, all four of them, but specifically one. And, since I have five letters and four other people, I thought the other four people might be great. To handle some of the other letters. So, a uh, gentleman I refer to as Gino. Tixna is a mystical name for the letter P. He is going to take the P, which means mouth in Hebrew, and take Vajramaya Sutri out of mounting thread to sew it shut and reduce it to silence. So that's the P. Goodbye.
Ah, well, I'm going to have to change that. I'm going to have to change what one of them in particular is. So, the M. Young lady I've uh, referred to as Susie before. Veta, or the mystical name for the letter M, means water. In Hebrew, so she is going to take that veta and make it zuzrote, uh, or become dry. So, no M, no P. So, uh, Patrick. He is going, well, steel specifically. He is going to have the Crodini R. Fresh means face. So, knockout. Yup. That's where it's at. So right now, someone's missing a lot of body parts and three of the letters of their name. That's a bad situation to be in. So. Let us see. What are the correspondences this? To the T that I'm gonna have to make. Rules the skeleton. Oh my. Oh my. The T rule is one of the things I haven't taken out of yet. Oh, that's terrible for him. It is not wise, as someone who has lots of wealth and power, to decide that, you know, Rando, who isn't Rando to you, has to be the best person in the world to mess with, thinking you're going to get away with it forever, because honestly... As far as most people are concerned, I'm a rando. Shouldn't have come to this. Yet, here we are. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, wait a minute. Of course. Well, here's the thing. Marianne. Not the one who, whose eggs are involved. But another one. She gets the Kamika. The Kamika needs to get crossed. Why? Because that's what you do with Kamikas. And so, I hand it off to her. She crosses it. That means there's literally only one letter left. Can you guess which one it is? Thank you for watching. Please feel free to like, comment, share, and subscribe.